if there is one decimal place in the question, there will usually be one decimal place in the answer. So we can apply the division facts that we already know to decimals. So for our first question, we have something divided by 9 equals 0 0.9. We know that 81 divided by 9 is 9. So 8.1 divided by 9 is 0 0.9. We have one decimal place in the question because there is one decimal place in the answer. So pause the video and see if you can answer the rest of the questions on this page. We know that 25 divided by 5 is 5. So 2.5 divided by 5 is 0 0.5. 36 divided by 9 is 4. So 3.6 divided by 9 is 0 0.4. 16 divided by 8 is 2, so 1.6 divided by 8 is 0 0.2. 18 divided by 3 is 6, so we have 1.8. And 30 divided by 6 is 5. So we have 3.0 but we know that 3.0 is just 3. So for this last question, we have a whole number as our answer. So here, we're dividing a whole number, but we still get a decimal as our, as our answer. And that's always what happens when doing the division would give you a remainder. So here, doing the division would give you 0, remainder 3. 